Okay, so today I'm going to talk about a risk that, uh, excuse me, today I'm going to talk about a flow that I put together for a project that I worked on. And the purpose of the flow is when a member is considered to be at risk in completing the program, what we want to do is create a new task and assign that task to a user. And that user is supposed to make contact with that at-risk member to talk to them about their, uh, their at-risk status and see how they can be helped. So the user assigned should make contact with the member within two days. So what I'm doing with this, I've already made this flow, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a few changes to it and we can go through it together and you can see what changes, how the changes affect the flow. So what I've got here is my flow and it is triggered on the member object. The member object is also known as the account object. It's just been renamed from account to member. So what we're going to do is when a record is updated, we're going to check this. And so our condition to be met is we've got a, a field called at risk. And when that equals yes, then we're going to create a, a new task. So this, this is what's, what our, our condition is. We're going to, and we're going to choose action and related records there. I'll say, okay, so the next piece that we need to do is we need to create this task record. So I'm going to go into this and I'll show you the changes that we're going to make. So we've got, we've named it create task. We're going to create one record. We're going to use separate resources and literal values. So we're creating a record of the, the task object. So one of the things that we need to fill is in the field is the activity date. So what I'm going to do here is I'll show you what we did uh, today. I had today plus one, but I'm going to change my requirement to be today plus two. So what we'll do is we'll go in here and we'll set up a new resource. And we're going to select a formula. And we're going to call it today plus two. All right, so our data type is date. So we'll put in our formula here. And we'll check the syntax. Okay, it likes that. All right, so now we've got our today plus two in there as our value. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this text a little bit. So we said member is at risk. So I added please contact. So we'll know uh, that our record has changed a little bit. So for the owner ID, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this to a different person. I got to go get their ID information. So we're going to change it to Sarah Lockett as our user. And what we'll do is we'll go up here and get her ID information. So we don't need the 2F, that's the first two characters, but we need the rest of this right here before the percent. So I'm going to copy that to the clipboard. Now I'll go back over here to our flow if I can find it, and we'll change this value. All right, and then I also changed this subject line to be members at risk. Please contact as soon as possible. And then, so our record right here is, is the account ID. That's the member, the member's ID, ID who's at risk right now. So we'll click done and we'll hit save as we're just going to save it as a new version. All right. And then we're going to activate the flow. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to come over here and we'll take Krista right here and we'll make her as at risk. So we'll change her status to at risk is yes. And we need to put in a date for her for at risk. And we put today in and hit save. And I think I might have another thing I have to change in here. We'll see. Okay. I need a date volunteer project is completed. So I'm just going to make that a day in the past. We'll save that. All right, so now we'll go to our tasks and 
if I refresh this, I should have a new task in here. Okay, so Krista McIntosh is now at risk. We need to contact her as soon as possible. So if I select her, uh, it's now assigned to Sarah Lockett. So she is the person who needs to get in touch with Krista McIntosh. So if I look at this, the due date is 214. Today is 212. So this is two days in the future that um, Sarah should contact uh, Krista within those two days. All right, this ends the flow discussion. I hope this was helpful. Thank you very much.